pretty late, like it's it's pretty late right now. It's 10:41 p.m. These just arrived, so I'm gonna come. I'm gonna build these because I've been waiting a long time for these to arrive. I've been waiting all day, and so look at her. So is she. And if you're wondering what this is, this is Gooey's first cat tower. See, she's already rearing to go. So let's build this real quick. So it is gonna go in this corner here, right up against the window. Which does mean I need to move this light and find somewhere new for this light. And I think I'm gonna have to shift the sofa this way a little bit as well. First, I'm gonna open these boxes up and just kind of see what we're working with. Can we try to help open the box? Ooh, you're a little shaky here. All right, get off, Gooey, get off, come on, off. Get off. Get off, Gooey. Get off. Get off. Or don't, you know, it's fine. All right, let's go for the big one first. This one is much lighter though, so. <coughs> it wasn't really expecting this to come in two parts. Gooey, go play with that over there. I think these are all the little attachments that go up the catch tree. Oh no, this is the... Oh jeez, this is way bigger than I expected. Wow. Okay. All right. So somebody is gonna be a very happy cat because this is part of the cat tower. Comes with a whole like hiding house. And all of this comes off. This wood is really high quality as well. Wow. So I guess the rest of this other box is just the rest of the cat tree. Oh wow, this is some proper heavy duty stuff. This is all made of metal and everything. I wasn't expecting that. Jeez. What else we got here? Uh, got some little pillows. Nice material. Everything is Velcro as well, so it shouldn't move around too much. Some more pads. This looks like the bottom base. Oh no, this is the top base. Instruction manual, little catnip toy. Oh, some more platforms. Wow, all of this is really high quality. And this was actually, I didn't actually buy this. This was actually a gift for Gooey. So it is really is Gooey's lucky day. Kind of my lucky day as well, because I get to build this and watch Gooey play on it. So I guess let's just start building this. I also arrived earlier in the day. <laughs> On top of the cat tower, this is like a ramp which goes up and connects in. And even this, this was huge as well already. And I was like, shit, how is this all going to fit? But I guess it will fit. It's just going to be very big and very noticeable. But you know what? Gooey's going to love it. And anything for Gooey. So the way this actually works, I guess, there's loads of these metal pipe sections. And they give you this giant like spanner which like slots in here and you can tighten it. Then you wrap those sections with this carpet stuff. And in between each of these sections, you can put the little platforms and stuff. I don't know how many platforms, like I've got one, two, two platforms and then this ramp thing, which is what's in here. And that all connects together. I'll figure it out. Okay, well, so I got this thing up and running I guess. I think I might in the week sort of like rearrange this a little bit but for now this is what I've got going on. It is a little bit awkward but let me show you what we've got going here. So this is that big ramp that I showed you on the side there and then it's got a couple of platforms. I'm not too sure about these because uh, I didn't want to put I didn't want to put it right at the bottom because I felt like the one right at the bottom only like a foot off the ground might have been a bit useless. So I did raise them up like a couple feet off the ground, like two feet. Then this one's probably like four feet. And then we've got this and this has to be at this height because that's just how that is set up. And then I've got the, the sort of like house right at the top because I feel like she would like it being up there. And also it's just kind of out of the way above head height. So no one's really going to hit it or anything like that. They sent this like double size section, which kind of makes things a bit awkward and difficult to handle. Because if this was split into two sections, I could bring this down one section, which I think would have been a bit nicer, but we'll do this for now. 
Gooey seems to like it. <laughs> She's been loving this thing. Been all over it. But she has experience with cat towers because she goes to my friend's house where she has a cat tower, so she's been climbing over that thing all the time. But she's also in a bit of a playful mood right now. It's pretty late right now, it's like 12.30 at night, so we'll come back to this tomorrow morning. Still awake. Just, just been drinking a beer and Gooey has been all over this thing all night. I put up a little toy fish for her. She absolutely loves this thing. She loves climbing. Hey, Gooey. You having fun? Do nothing if you're having fun. Oh, she did something. Can you climb up? Like I said, though, I might rearrange this a little bit. I don't like that awkward, huge gap in the middle. Although Gooey doesn't seem to mind. Ooh, they're tasty. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, get in there. Imagine if people did this with their back feet. Back feet with our feet. That'd be weird. We should get in there in the nails and the toes. Okay, I'll stop. I'll stop recording this now. behind me. Gooey has finally got herself a cat tower. Isn't that right, Gooey? You enjoying your cat tower? This thing is quite big and it does take up a considerable amount of real estate in the living room, but you know what? I love it. I think it works pretty well in that spot. And that was kind of unused anyway, so it's not a problem. I woke up she sleeps with me anyway and I woke up and she came out here and she went straight to her spot which the whole plan with this was to put this right here next to the window so she could look outside and boy does it have quite the view keep looking outside Gooey ignore me Gooey it's floor to ceiling which seems to be quite common in Korea I'm not too sure if these are really available elsewhere but it came with a couple platforms which every single one has these, these mats on them, which have like these buttons which button down. And it came with some spares as well, so that's also good. These middle bits are basically poles, but this carpet stuff comes off as well. So this is all washable, I guess. Removable, washable, replaceable, which is great. And it's just like one giant scratching pole for her. It came with, this was an addition that we got as well which is just sort of like just a ramp that goes up so she can climb up here and then sit up here. And then this was another like sort of addition as well, which is kind of like a, a little house in here, which I need to put a cushion in because it's bare at the moment. But actually this is supposed to go in here. So let's put this in here. So she's got her little hiding space up here, which is up top. I wanted to put it up top just so it's sort of like out the way uh, no one will hit the head on it and Gooey can have like a little vantage point up top But she hasn't really used it yet. Maybe it's too high up I definitely am thinking about like rearranging this maybe but for now I'm gonna try it like this See how she likes it I'm hoping she starts to use the top a bit more But if she doesn't I might lower that down a little bit and then instead just put one of these platforms up top The only thing is I had to stuff this top gap here with like a towel and just some of the extras because She kept climbing up into there. I don't really want her up there I want her to use the actual house. Isn't that right, Gooey? See, she loves scratching on this. So I tried to get more footage of me building it, and I tried try to do a time lapse with this camera, but it, for some reason, I don't know, maybe I got some of the settings wrong. It didn't really come out, so I didn't really get much of like the building. But all it is is just screwing all these sections together and then putting like one of these platforms in between and then using that sort of plunger thing at the, on the roof there. Really basic, really simple, but it was kind of like a little bit exhausting. It was a little bit like a puzzle putting this thing together as well. And the entire time, of course, Gooey is trying to climb on while I'm building the thing, but she loves it. She's been on this all day. 
came with this little <clears throat> fish toy, which I think is very appropriate considering we live by the ocean here, which uh, came with a little baggie of catnip, which I filled it in with. You're just supposed to dangle it off there, and she seems to play with it sometimes. Gooey is no stranger to cat towers, and she does love a good cat tower. So it's finally nice to get her her own sort of pretty, pretty nice cat tower. Wasn't expecting it to be this nice. But I just, I love the color because it kind of matches her, kind of matches the house as well. So the rest of this video will just be <laughs> videos of Gooey using the cat tower, I guess. <laughs> Enjoy. more interest in the string, huh? <laughs> what are you doing, Gooey? You should sleep up there more often. Maybe I should, I should stuff it with some more towels or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> 